At the start of every season, there's a new player being touted as the next big thing. Golf is as guilty of it as any other sport. The trouble is, this year, the European Tour is bursting at the seams with bright young talent. With nine Europeans in the world's top 20, the problem could be picking who to watch at the commercial bank Qatar Masters. So far, Germany's Martin Keimer has stood out. The 25-year-old opened 2010 with a win at the Abu Dhabi Golf Championship last week, his fifth title on the tour and his second at that event. It was important for me two years ago already when I had my first win in Abu Dhabi. It gives you a good start and good motivation for the rest of the season, especially the tournaments uh, are coming up now, you know, the, the big events in America, the World Golf Champion event, which is next, next month, and uh, the Masters, they're coming up in a few or in a couple, a couple of months, so it's, it's nice to start off like this. Well, a win so early in the season is always desirable, but for young players like Martin Keimer, it could prove crucial with the European Ryder Cup places up for grabs. Keimer missed out on a place in the squad in 2008, instead travelling with them to Kentucky as a guest of then-captain Nick Faldo. And that gave the German a taste for team competition and a desire to make it into the lineup this time around. When I got the invitation from Nick Faldo, it was, um, it was a, such a great experience for me. And since then, I, I realized that I really want to be there one day. And um, after this, this win that I had on Sunday, I think I put myself in a good position. But his place is far from assured. He'll need to pick up enough ranking points over the coming months to make it onto the European team that will play the Americans in Wales in October. Competition for team places and the title at this week's Commercial Bank Qatar Masters is tough. The field features former Ryder Cup players Lee Westwood, Sergio Garcia, Ian Poulter and Paul Casey. And you can't rule out a charge from defending champion Alvaro Quiros. The Spaniard was entertaining his fellow players during practice for this week's event. And although he hasn't won a tournament since last year here in Doha, Quiros is feeling in confident mood. Well, I've been working on the winter time uh, on my swing. Last week in Abu Dhabi was uh, a good result, with a little bit of bad luck on the last round. So I hope to have the same luck or even better. The conditions are expected to be tough for the week with the rough long and a strong wind. So whoever can cope with the weather will have a good chance of emerging victorious on Sunday. Joanna Gajeroska, Al Jazeera, Doha.